Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel. Today I'm starting my vlog for my IFBB Bikini Pro debut at the Wings of Strength Chicago Pro Show on July 24th. So, if you're confused, <laughs> because a lot of you guys know that this is actually my first ever season competing ever um, in the MPC. Um, and now I am actually an IBB Bikini Pro. So if you're confused, go watch the last video. I'll have it linked down below or in like one of the little cards or both, you know. But go watch that if you're a little confused and that should sum everything up for you. I am actually going to be doing our pro debut, like I said, at the Chicago Pro in Atlanta, Georgia. And I'm so excited. It's literally like full circle. I did my debut my NPC debut my first ever show actually in Atlanta as well um and now I'm returning to Atlanta to compete again but as a pro and that was just a month ago which is insane so I'm freaking excited so we want to just see like where do I line up with my physique right now you know my physique at its very best right now where do i line up you know doing my pro debut and then we are hanging it up for um the season i'm not sure for how long um but i will go into an improvement season um and we will start building back up some muscle and stuff like that but for now we're just going to focus on this show this peak week and today is actually day number one of peak week today's saturday so we are exactly one week out i showed you guys my first meal of the day which is also my pre-workout meal um and yeah so i'm on my way to the gym now actually getting my last lift in um because for peak week starting on monday of peak week i don't actually do full-on training sessions i just do pump-up sessions um also i am staying at my parents house right now i actually move into my new apartment um in two weeks exactly so i'm um, currently staying with my parents so that's like the scenery that you see in the home that i'm in and stuff like that and if you see my parents in the vlogs <laughs> that is why Hello, you beautiful humans. Happy Monday. Today is Monday, like I said, of peak week. And I would say today is like when peak week really starts. During peak week, we do not heavy lift or anything like that because we do not want any inflammation. I also start the exfoliation process for my skin um, so the tan can go on nice and smooth. I'm honestly expecting a macro drop today um, just so we can get to where we need to be because I'm still like for like we have like a target weight for this show and we are not there <laughs> um because my body 
has been through a lot and just like a lot of other bodybuilders and my body's really just starting to um you know fight back a little bit and doesn't want to lose any more weight so okay guys so we have meal number two right here so it is basically my egg white oats so i did a mix of oats chia seeds and egg whites all in the microwave and then topped it off with some banana which i actually normally would slice up and put like around here but i decided to be a little different today and try something else out and i actually mashed up the banana to make it more creamy and mashed it up and mixed it into the oat mixture and then topped it with cinnamon and then my nut free like peanut butter substitute which is wild butter and let it sit there for a little bit and it got a little melty and yeah so this is post-workout and meal number two i am outside at like a little sitting area at my house um i've been like loving sitting outside and just enjoying like the fresh air don't really know why normally i'm not that type of person but Bleh. excuse me so i'm gonna eat Sorry if you can't even hear me. That's like the air conditioner thing. But um, yeah, so I'm gonna eat. Um, and then I'm gonna go walk and do my cardio. And then I don't know what else I'm gonna do, but I will show you guys. Okay guys, so meal number four is, or meal number three is actually on the go. We just have some Yukon gold potatoes that were cooked in the air fryer. And then I also have um, center cut pork chop um, that's also made in the air fryer. Everything seasoned with salt and pepper. And yeah, but I actually am on the way to go to an infrared sauna. So I'm going to literally eat this really freaking quick and then be on my way. Um, so yeah, but I'm going to go to infrared sauna, sweat out the bullshit because <laughs> I just had like a little mental breakdown. We don't need to get into it, but just need to go sweat some, you know, so I'm going to go do that. And I will see you guys after. Hey guys, so I literally just got back and I'm leaving again, um, but not going far. I'm just going to get my cardio in. 15 minutes of walking, keeping my heart rate 130 plus so got my sweet sweat band on heart rate monitor on and we're, we're good to go i think my mom took my dog on a walk even though i literally just took her on one i don't think she knew so my dog got two walks in one day i bet she's happy okay guys so this is meal number four and you guys are probably like what in the world so I made some pancakes with oats, egg whites, cinnamon, a little bit of stevia, uh, what else? Chia seeds. And I put blackberries in there. Um, so like I made blackberry oatmeal pancakes. And then, so basically I smashed the, uh, the blackberries so there weren't like big old blackberries in there. Um, and then I left a little bit in there to put on top um i've been having this with a little bit of like wow butter like peanut butter substitute drizzle it tastes like a little like peanut butter and jelly action but my coach changed my macros today so i had to adjust okay so last meal we just have some sweet potato and 96 percent ground beef not gonna lie it doesn't taste that great. I'm so used to having 93%, which is so freaking good on its own with no sauce or no anything. But 96% is pushing it with no sauce, but it's it tastes a little bit better when you eat the sweet potato and the beef together. So that's what I'm doing, but that is my last meal of the day. I look crazy, but I want to preface that you guys didn't see like any vegetables in this full day of eating because during peak week, I've actually been cutting veggies out because they give me a lot of gas and they tend to bloat me so I just stay away from them during peak week but I do promise you that I do eat my vegetables um maybe still not as many as I should eat or as much as I should eat but I do eat vegetables just I haven't been doing it during peak
Hey guys, so today is Wednesday. We are three, we're three days out today for my pro debut and I'm so freaking excited. Um, I am on my way to get my hair did. Um, you guys know I get my hair straightened, flat iron, stuff like that for shows. And yeah, so that is what I'm going to do now. I did my last cardio session, like official cardio session, last planned cardio session of prep. That's wild. Hi guys, so we just got the hair did and it is soaky freaking smooth. Literally, she slays it every single time. But now I'm on the way to get my brows did. And then we will be on our way home. Okay, so back in the car, got my eyebrows done. Beautiful. Literally, I go to a place, you might be able to see it, like right there. I go to a place that's literally called eyebrow threading. <laughs> literally nothing fancy, but the places that are just like not fancy at all are normally the best freaking places to go. Good morning, guys. It is Thursday six o'clock in the morning and we're headed to the airport well we're about to be headed to the airport just got in the car waiting for my mama and we're about to be on our way to atl Ugh. excuse me <laughs> i haven't eaten or drank anything today so i don't know what that is but um didn't get as much sleep as i wanted to last night just because i had to finish getting ready so i might honestly catch up on some sleep on the plane Maybe even when I get there. But we will see. And yeah, nothing else. Hey guys, so it is later on. It's about to be 11.30 and I am at my hotel. Here's the view, you know, not, that, not too shabby. And I just got everything set up. So we have my food, bags, beds that one's mine obviously with all the black this one's gonna be my sister's when she gets here stuff bags oh fridge with my egg whites of coolers and everything else we got that we got the mirror oh so it's oh i'm nipping so hard right now whatever and i don't know why i'm doing everything with the front piece of camera but bathroom it's actually like a very like a good size not cramped at all which is gonna be good for tanning um oh my nose is so itchy i know there's a whole microwave room but because we're staying at the host hotel it's the grand hyatt and buckhead or grand hyatt in atlanta buckhead um but i know there is a microwave room but I think there also might be a microwave on my floor. So I'm gonna go see that, see if they have one on my floor, because if they do, that would make things so much easier. So we're gonna go search for that. When I say that they just wanna make things so, just go, things go so smoothly for me this weekend, I mean it. So we got here and originally they were like, okay, we only have one room ready which is my parents room so then i'd have to wait for my room which was fine like i really wasn't tripping but then they were like oh wait we actually do have another room ready so i'm in my room but also my room's right off the elevator so we're not taking any extra steps um and also there is a microwave on my floor and it's right next to my room so no microwave room for me i'm gonna make my oatmeal because your girl's hungry um and then i don't know what else i'm gonna do i don't have check-ins until five so i might not talk to you guys until then because there's nothing else to film <laughs>
muscle fitness something. It's a water bottle. It's cool. It's a regular water bottle. Got a little wolf pack wristband. Oh, yeah, that was, yeah. Little ditty, little towel. Soft. Then we have pre workout cotton candy. And then a cookie. I don't know what kind. It's from the brand Obsessive Cookie Disorder. I don't know what kind you are, though. Is it just chocolate chip? Chunky. Chunky wonky monkey, but normally when something's chunky monkey, it's not. Guys, I'm allergic to nuts, and I always get cookies that have nuts in them. But luckily, I brought my own cookie. Oh shoot, my hair is wild. Good morning, guys. So today is Friday. We are one day out. I started my tan last night. And we are, like I said, one day out. I just checked in with my coach, waiting for her response. My hair looks crazy, but I'm actually about to head over to the grocery store. It's about a seven minute walk um, because I ran out of my Yukon Gold potatoes and I need some more. So I'm gonna go get some, just a little bit um, to finish off today. And then, you know, Saturday, I don't eat potatoes, I'll eat rice and stuff like that. But I'm so excited. Today I woke up and was just like, I have a good feeling. Like, like it's gonna be a good check-in. And we hit our like our goal weight. Um, we had like a range and I hit the range. Like I originally, so it was like something 0.5 to something on the dot. And during the week I hit the dot. And today I hit like 0.1 below the 0.5, so 0.4. So if that makes sense. <laughs> I don't want to like give away like the weight because weight doesn't matter. It, it's not really guys' business, but I do like to elaborate. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go grab these potatoes and then head on back so I can eat my first meal. And then I have a glute ham pump up today. And I think later on, we're actually gonna go walk over to like the mall area because we're in Buckhead, um, which is just like, you know, bougie. They got all the, they got Chanel, they got Louis Vuitton, they got all the good stuff, so. Um, we're just gonna go see what they have. <laughs> hey guys, so I just got dressed, did my second coat of tan, and I just have my fanny pack on, black sports bra, FBF leggings, and I'm actually, can I, okay. I'm actually headed down, oh we got the mirrors in here, okay. Headed down to the competition, because they're competing today. Um, just to go to the Fit Body Fusion booth real quick to say hi, and then I'm gonna go pump up and get this booty popping. It's the lighting for me. Hi guys, so it's show day. Sorry, you probably can't hear me. I'm in the ice room. And yeah, but I'm heating up my meal, and then I'm about to head to, where am I about to head to? Makeup. So this is gonna be the last time you guys see me looking like a mess. Hi guys, so I'm all dressed, hair's done. Makeup's done, suits on, jewelry's on, everything's on, and we are headed downstairs for my pro debut. So I'm just freaking excited. I'm literally just so freaking excited. Um, I'm just ready to do it, basically. So yeah, let's do it, guys. Hey, guys. So I'm back from pre-judging. I've been back. I actually just touched up my hair touched up my tan and all that stuff. I'm about to touch up my lips um, and head back down for finals. Finals start at four. It's like 325 right now. 
um, but prejudging actually went a lot better than I expected. I went to the show with absolutely zero expectations and I feel like that's honestly a really good way to go into your pro debut because the pros, <laughs> it's like a whole nother world. It's like a whole other, it's just very different from competing in, in the NBC to the IFBB. It's a lot, but yeah, but I actually ended up um, thinking it's a top 10 finish. Um, and I was in technically second call outs, but I, they put me into, they took out like the top three from first call outs and then put me into it with some of the other girls that were in first call outs as well. Feeling really good. So, um, yeah, like I said, I'm literally just happy to be here. Happy, blessed, excited, and also happy and excited to eat food later on. We are getting pizza, we're getting ice cream, and just having fun. I have family here, my sister's here, my aunt, my uncle here, my parents are here. So it's just, I'm just really excited to spend time with them. Um, oh yeah, these are extensions, by the way. Don't think I showed you guys them. Amazon extensions, guys. Amazon, okay? Um, but yeah, so... I'm just going to chill for a tiny bit more, then touch up my lips, and then head down to finals. So I will talk to you guys after. Hi guys, so it is later on, obviously. Um, no longer in my suit, but, oh God. Whatever, no longer in my suit, but I still have makeup on, look a little crazy, but it's okay, I'm headed Headed to dinner. I'll give you guys a whole recap of how everything went, but I did make top 10. 21st floor, going up. And yeah, but I will give you guys like a whole recap of everything later on. But for now, I'm just gonna go chill with my family, eat some good food, and enjoy my time. I'm looking a little crazy it's because I'm editing and I realized that I never actually talked about how the show went so I thought I would pop in real quick and talk about it so I mentioned in the video that I thought it was going to be a top 10 finish and I was correct it was a top 10 finish but it was also a top 7 finish so I actually ended up getting seventh place in my very first pro show and that was more than I could have ever asked for being there was more than I could have asked for um, standing next to Laura Lee Chapados was more than I could ever ask for. The whole thing. The whole thing, honey. I can't wait. I cannot wait to get on a pro stage again. But at the same time, I can't wait. <laughs> but I got some place and I'm really, really happy with that. Um, it was a really great way to end off my season. Um, I could have done a another show. In fact, my coach actually kind of wanted me to do another show, but I need to take a step back um, and get my crap together in my life, um, especially because I already surpassed my goal, which was to just, I mean, it was to go pro. Um, so I went pro and not only did I do that, but I also did my pro debut. So two goals in one, I'm cool. And I feel satisfied with how the season went, which is why I went to an improvement season. So currently in improvement season now, I am going to be kind of vlogging throughout my improvement season. I have no idea how long it's going to be. So enjoy the ride. <laughs> Next video that you guys see will be a physique update and all that stuff um, post show. So yeah, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope I got enough footage for you guys. I feel like it was a lot better vlog than my last one um, because I, I really made sure that I, I, got, I got some footage for y'all or at least I tried to. So yeah, but now I hope you guys enjoy these photos and yeah if you want to see the full photos because i wasn't able to put in like the entire photo for some reason when i was editing janky if you would like to see like the full photo go follow pull, 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 go follow me on instagram at kendall chase underscore ifbb pro very long handle now but i wanted to add ifbb pro in there you know so yeah but um i hope you guys enjoyed and i love you so much and i will see you guys in my next video Toodaloo.